Get ready to match the stars. Joe Flynn, Brett Summers, Charles Nelson Riley, Linda K. Henning, Richard Dawson, and Betty White as we play the star-studded Big Money Match Game 74. And now, here's the host of Match Game 74, Gene Rayburn. All right, this is a new position for my mic. I lay it right there, and that way I won't fall on it when I come down. Thank you very much for the warmth of your reception Lovely. and for joining us. And we'd like to welcome two new bodies, wouldn't we, regulars? <laughs> Why not? Linda and Joe, it's nice to have you with us. <laughs> Joe, uh... Yeah, is Super Dad out? Is that in general release now? Super Dad, my new movie for yeah. Disney? Yeah, yes. yes, it's out in yeah. selected sites. You have a career with Disney, do you? <laughs> Seems that way. They haven't heard about me yet. <laughs> You've done a lot of them, haven't you? I've done about uh, 12 pictures over there. Really? Are you happy about that? I'm very happy about it. It keeps me off the streets <laughs> and uh, out of the unemployment office. And you've done uh, you've done a whole series of TV shows with Charles Nelson Riley, haven't oh, you? 39 with Charles Nelson. It 39? pays to be ignorant, is that it? half hours. Yeah. Yeah. Remarkable how his health has held up, too. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a healthy girl down here. I, uh, uh, we've never worked together, have we? No, we haven't. We've nice never to... played together. <laughs> no, that's right. How are you at Fun and Games? I love it. Would you like to play a game? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen you since the last time I saw you on Petticoat Junction. That's still running around, isn't it? It is. I've been doing a lot of theater. I've been you running are? around, yeah. Where do you play? <laughs> uh, yeah, do you, uh, dinner playhouses, that a sort of thing? A lot of dinner theaters, uh, tent theaters, you name it. Proscenium okay. theaters, I'll barns, build a tent for you, and uh, you can, we'll do an act together. What do you say we garage. say hello to our two players here? Janet Iverson and Brenda Lee Merriweather, ladies. I don't know why. Seems like a long time since yeah. yesterday, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Janet Iverson is challenging our current champ here, Brenda Lee Merriweather, who has $6,300 to her credit. She's won three games, and she's happy about that. You have a new hairdo, Brenda Lee. I like it. Thank you. Looks very chic and charming. Thank you. Uh, last time we were together, we started a game, and we got through Janet's question. She matched one celebrity, and we're going to pick up at that point, and we'll have a question for you right after we have this message for you. Here we go! <laughs> They're all set. Uh, to refresh your memories, Janet's finished her end of the round. She matched uh -huh. one celebrity. And now we'll uh, get to Brenda Lee's end of the round, and we've got this for you. Brenda Lee, are you ready? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> are you ready, folks? Oh, Here yeah. it is. Yeah. Everybody plays. In sure. Dancing the Hula, every movement tells a story. Yeah. When Lola hulas, the best part of the story is told by her blank. <laughs> all right. Oh. You've all seen the hula? Yeah. Have you seen the hula, yes, Joe? Yes. Nice. Oh, yes, you did all of those shows in the <laughs> South Pacific. South Pacific, <laughs> that's right. Joe would be familiar with the hula. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're all set over here, so we'll call on Brenda Lee. When Lola hulas, the best part of the story is told by her... Hips. Her hips. <laughs> Sounds logical to me. Yeah. All right, Joe, she says hips. What do you say? Well, she's been such a good girl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I said hips. You're going to reward her with a match there. OK, there's one for you, Brenda. Brett? Do you know I threw hips away? You threw hips away? Oh, Absolutely. <laughs> I don't look now. Out. Somebody <laughs> just brought them back to you. <laughs> What have you got there? But it sort of is the same thing. It's wriggling. By her wriggling. <laughs> okay, uh, yeah. you get a, a loud buzz on that, Charles. One day. I didn't go the obvious route. I said her hands, which are so lovely. Yeah. Oh, they're so expressive and graceful there. Okay. Now, we're looking for your first answer here, Linda. Brandon and I hula in the same circles. Hips it is. Okay. 
All right, Richard. Yes, I use the Irish word, derriere. Derriere. Irish for hip. What? Oh. That doesn't match? Oh. You bring your derriere over here. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It no, he says no. Nope. Do that again for me. <laughs> Thank you. Let's Carry go on. on to Betty White there. The best part of her story is told by her tail. Uh. Now my tail is told. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what I tail? I love your spelling. Thank Terrific. You. So how'd you do with that? Oh. You got two there. All right, we'll go to round two. Ask Janet Iverson, a challenger, to make a selection. B, please. B it is. Last time you matched... Who'd you match, Linda? Okay, so. Get your Any Eskimo yeah. stories there for us? No. Oh, all right. <laughs> you will not participate. Okay? I love Eskimo stories. We, we do have those from time to time. Good. We may have one later in the program. <laughs> Susan. I like them. <laughs> Susan gets a headache every time Fred gets blank. Oh. Susan gets a headache every time Fred gets blank. <laughs> No conferring up there. Everybody's on his own here. <laughs> oh, you came with this girl, did you? Yeah. Okay. But you want separate checks, is that it? Yes. Oh, okay. We Eskimos have to stick together. <laughs> don't take a book from All right, Brett, you ready? Okay. Janet, Susan gets a headache every time Fred gets... Drunk. Drunk. And Fred gets a headache every time Fred gets yes, drunk, too. Yeah. What do you say, Joe? I say she gets a headache every time he gets loud. Every time he gets loud. Drunk right. and loud. Drunk and loud. Brett? I get a headache every time I get drunk. I said uh, stimulated. Stimulated. OK. All right, Charles. OK, there you go with the match, eh? Drunk. There's one. And we come down here to Richard. What do you say, sir? I stimulated is she up there? <laughs> <laughs> headache every time he gets sexy. Sexy. Hence the expression, not tonight, dear. Okay. I've got a drunk on my head. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to Betty White. This goes along with derriere. It's a oh. French term, amorous. <laughs> amorous. No match there. Just so. Of Texas. <laughs> what have we got here? That's right. There's a light out here. Whose well, light is home. out? Oh, wait a minute. Let's uh, hold it. You mean Brenda has three? Is that it? No. Oh, well, that's right. It should be sure. two. Charles, Matt. Two here. Lovely Janet. So at this moment, we have a tie score. All right. It's good to get these things all out of your system. That's right. <laughs> Everybody all set in the periphery. You can't see what's going on in the wings here, but they're all mixed up there. <laughs> and we straightened them out, didn't we? We straightened them out. Okay. Now, Brenda Lee, all you need is one match to win the game, and we'll find out if that happens right after we find out about this message. <laughs> 